What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, yes, we have defeated Price for our seventh gym badge. Let's go right ahead and take a look at this, because we didn't even show it in the last episode. Look at that. We are seven down, and we got one more, but there's a big, big, big old butt right here. Something is afoot, and we're talking about big old foot. That's right, Team Rocket is at it again because apparently they have taken over the radio station back in Goldenrod. So now it is finally time for us to take care of Team Rocket themselves and get some good battling, get some good ass whoopings and all that stuff. So let's go back to Goldenrod City. Now there is a bit of a situation. All entrances, I believe, have been closed. So yeah, we, we, we definitely have to take over and beat these guys now as you guys can see hey Brett you don't belong here get lost yeah we're getting yelled at from all ends because well team rocket you know that's who they are and all that crud so what's going to happen here look at this they're they're taking over all of goldenrod right here <laughs> Tee -hee. you gym trainers can be a problem stay in the gym or stay out of our way hmm okay so there's only one man that can actually help we train we gym trainers will never allow team rocket to do nasty things here in our city now, they do have Whitney. Whitney herself can actually beat these guys, but, eh, you know, and they need a hero, and I am that hero. So, here we are in uh, the radio station. Now, they did add a little bit of a curveball right here. We can't add, we can't go inside, or we can't go up to, to the top floor right here, because this guy right here is blocking the way. He's gonna like, who are you? We have business going on. I was not going, going or I'm not, or I was told not to let anyone pass instead of, but Team Rocket, do you understand? You're only allowed to come through when you're wearing a cool black uniform to Team Rocket. Now, there is only one place where we can actually do such a thing. And that means we have to go underground. So, let's go right ahead and take care of this business right here. Let's go right ahead and uh, go underground. If you guys remember, we went underground a few episodes ago to battle a whole bunch of people and all that crud. And while we're at it, let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go with Cinder right here. Because, uh, yeah, we kind of need uh, him to evolve and all that stuff. And this guy's going to notice us. He's going to be like, huh, are you a newcomer too? We had to recruit new members for the radio uh, tower mission. Then we ran out of uniforms. I heard the studio has some, so I decided to borrow one. Since you are here, why don't you change as well? And just like that, guys, we are wearing a Team Rocket uniform. He's like, look at you. Pretty good. Oh, but you shouldn't try to scare people walking around looking uh, like that, okay? <laughs> so we are part of Team Rocket now. Look at that. Oh, my God. If, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, just just wait. Just wait until you see the, the regular civilians right here. They're going to be looking at you like, wait, why are you wearing that uniform? Aren't you young for this? Like this person right here. Look, let's go ahead and talk. Yes, Team Rocket can be can use the tunnel too. She's talking to us like if we were from Team Rocket. And let's see. What else? Let's go right ahead and talk to this person right here. Hey, hey I've got this covered. Why don't you go to the radio tower? Yeah, the attitudes change. Let's go right ahead and talk to, let's see, let's talk to this gym, 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 gym trainer. He's like, get out of my way. We as gym trainers will never allow Team Rocket to do anything. Well, yeah, okay. So they're going to be saying some stuff right here. So obviously everybody thinks we are part of Team Rocket. And, well, let's see. You look awfully young. Are you new? Yes, we are. And let's see. What are you doing? Get to your position right away. So everybody thinks I'm part of Team Rocket. <laughs> All right, the disguise is here. Let's go right ahead and take on this guy. <laughs> you must be new. You look pretty good in the Team Rocket uniform. Go on ahead. And would you look at this? This guy right here is going to be like, Hey, Team Rocket, stop going around in groups and troubling people, you cowards. And then he notices us, and he's going to be like, Silver, or, huh, are you Draven? What are you doing here? No way. You think you're strong now and you look and, and that you look like them? That's foolish. You should wear those things. And just like that, we take off the uniform and ta-da. <laughs> what a surprise. It's like, what? You? You're not a newcomer? Then let's then battle me. Okay. Alrighty, so here we go. Taking on a Team Rocket member. And as always, we are gonna be speeding through this because, well, we kinda have to. And there we go, lava plume for the win comes with another Raticade Flame Wheel for the win. 
And just like that, we have defeated this guy. And he's gonna be like, You are too powerful. Or, yeah, you are too powerful. You plan to, or you could spoil our plan. I have to tell, inform the others. Okay, and this guy right here is like, I see. You were trying to be sneaky. Huh. <laughs> a typical idea of the meek. No matter. I'll let you handle this. I have to defeat a dragon tamer. What's his name? Lance. After that, I will turn you. I will be, or it will be your turn. Be ready for it. Okay. Alrighty, so. <laughs> I'm flipping him off because he knows that he's going to get a an A whooping. So, we got the glitch going on again. I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, like I was saying, guys, we had a glitch. As many of you guys already know, this game, this game and Pokemon Soul Silver get get a little bit of a glitch. The best way to go about it is to reset it, or save and then reset it, and that right there will actually help you out. So there we go. Look at that. Cinder grows to level 36, and well, we have defeated the Team Rocket Grunt. We're like yes. And as you guys already know, good old Cinder is ready to go. Okay, so we got Cinder digivolving to the badass, but yet not limited, our good old buddy, Typhlosion. Okay, alrighty. Take a look at that. We got Typhlosion, finally evolved and finally ready to go. And, well, let's go ahead and take a look at our newest Pokemon. Of, of course, our mother's going to be calling us because, well, you know, she worries. Here's Typhlosion, level 36 of pure brutality, homeboy. He's a special attacker. And, uh, well, I think our mission has been complete right here, so let's go ahead and take away that experience share. And it's time to start training other Pokemon, like the harder the, the harder Pokemon, like, you know, Fluff Volt. Hell, we got, uh, what was it called? What's his name? Uh, Thrasher. Let's go right ahead and give Thrasher a little bit of, uh, 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 of the experience share. And let's go right ahead and grab this charcoal right here because we, we're going to be needing this one right here. So let's go ahead and give that to Cinder. And not that. Let's go ahead and grab this Quick Claw. Who right here needs a Quick Claw? Uh, definitely not Togepi, but let's see. We're, we're going to continue on right here. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go ahead and uh, give... Let's give Hercules a bit of a, a love because I have yet to use him so many times right here. So bring it on. And yes, we're going to be speeding this whole three, this whole thing. As you guys can see, he has five Pokemon. And we're going to continue Brick Breaking everybody. And Brick Break again. Look at that. And Brick Break again. Look at that. Yeah, this guy has no chance because we're just Brick Breaking his rats. You know, you could have evolved all your Pokemon. That could have been just the thing right there. And, well, let's go right ahead and take on this guy right here. He's going to be like, hey, hey, keep out of our way. Alrighty, so let's go right ahead and speed this through. Horn attack for the win, and here comes a Zuban. So let's go with Fluffolt right now and Charge Beam. Let's get it. Charge Beam for the win, and there we go. Oh yes. Oh uh, yeah, we did. We did. We did good right here. So let's go right ahead and finish off everybody from Team Rocket. He's of course talking about the three years ago where we had stopped Team Rocket in the in the beginning. So they're making a comeback. And he's going to be coming out with his uh, Grimer. So let's go straight for a Horn Attack. And, of course, we're going to get poisoned. And, yes, we're going to be... Yeah, we're going to be poisoned. So let's go with Togepi right here. Togepi with the extra sensory. Look at that. And he's coming out with a Muck. So this is more experience points for all of us. But, nevertheless, we get ourselves a Fly Attack. Let's go again. And just like that, we have defeated good old Team Rocket member right here. So now we got to heal up our Pokemon because, well... Yeah, poison. It's been our thing right here. So we got one antidote. Yeah, we better not get poisoned again. So there we go. Hercules, you have been... You have been, uh, whatchamacallit, healed. So let's go right ahead and go in straight to the next area. And if you talk to these people, they're just, like, scared. They're scared out of their gorgeous because these guys are, like, using the Pokemon for uh, the wrong reasons. So let's go right ahead and take on another Team Rocket member right here. He's going to be having four Pokemon, so let's go right ahead and try and beat this guy. And of course, you're going to be going with Self-Destruct right here. Holy, holy buckets. Okay, so here we go. Charge Beam for the win. And Grimer's coming out, so let's go 
Let's go with a Thrasher. Obviously, this guy cannot get poisoned. And there we go. Grows to level 31. Let's keep him. And go straight for a double kick right here. And look at that. We win. Alrighty. Okay, so who's next? This guy might be next. And yes, he is one of these scientists right here that, you know, just doesn't... Yeah, like, you, you can mistake him for a worker of something else. And, well, he's coming out with a Magnemite. Let's go with his Brick Break for the win. And continue on right here. Heal our, heal our Pokemon with the Shell Bell right there. And he's going to be coming out with another Magnemite. And just like that, we win. Okay, alrighty. Bring it on. It feels good, or it feels great, ordering Pokemon to commit crimes. Yeah, I don't know why, but that's just... It, 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 it just doesn't sound good. Now, this looks like a self-destruct, so we gotta switch out our Pokemon. Let's go with... Let's go with Nessie right here. And go with the Surf Attack. And just like that, for the win. <laughs> okay, so we need a key. Obviously, we don't have it right now. Let's go right ahead and continue beating everybody right here. He's like, you plan to rescue the director? So sad that he it won't be possible because I'm going to beat you. Yeah. Okay, so here we go. Taking on another Team Rocket member. Here comes a horn attack for the win. And he's coming out with a gold bat. And yes. Healing up our Pokemon little by little. And he's going to be coming out with a Grimer. So let's go straight to Thrasher right here. And hit him with the dig attack. And just like that, we grow to level 32 with Thrasher. And yes. Alrighty, okay, so let's see. This is Mary's our radio show, and there is somebody right here. Proton, the leader of the radio the radio tower mission? He is so cool. <laughs> Who are you? If you are in the way of Proton, I I mean Team Rocket, I will allow that. Oh wow. So this person is in love with Proton, and it's a female. Okay, so let's go right ahead. Go with the horde attack right here. And well, let's continue on right here, horn attack. And, of course, we're going to get paralyzed because, you know, we are paralysis magnet. So, let's go straight to Cinder. Let's get Cinder right here, Lava Bloom, for the win. And finish this guy off with the Flame Wheel. There we go. And just like that, we win. Mm-hmm. Team Rocket and Proton are all I need. Who cares about Pokemon? Wow. She, 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 she's in love with the, the guy right here. I think that's what you guys call uh, simping. I don't know. I don't get you guys' lingo. Yeah. So, let's go right ahead. And continue on with this adventure right here. And this guy is going to be like, most excellent. This radio tower will fulfill our grand design. Oh, crap baskets. Okay, so here we go. Taking on a scientist. His name is Trenton. And he's going to be the one of the only people with a Porygon right here. And just like that, we win. Look at that. And, and poor, well, this guy's learning, uh, well, Hercules is learning takedown. And this this is a much more powerful move than horn attack, so let's go right ahead and switch it out. Although, yeah, there is some recoil, but it could come in handy just uh, for a little bit later on. And here we are at the very end of this tower, and, well, the director's right here, but, but, there's a big but. <laughs> Do you hear me? I am the director. We have decided to broadcast the wonderful shows to praise Team Rocket. Everyone, I just, or I don't want to hear you complain. Just do your job too. Uh-oh. Yikes. I am a busy, I am busy impersonating the, oh, who are you? Oh no. It's you again. Draven. Betrayal, huh? No, no, no. I was pretending to be the director to influence the entire region of the support Team Rocket. This time I will hold back. Give me all you've got. Okay, so here it is, guys. Taking on Petrel. And, well, Petrel right here is a Team Rocket executive. And he's going to be pretty strong because, of course, he's got like six of these Pokemon right here. So, let's go with Takedown Attack. And Takedown again. There we go. Look at that. And coming out with a Weezing. Let's go with Togepri right here since we do have the move. And Extra Sensory. We are poisoned. And just like that, we have defeated Weezing. Unfortunately, you know, Togepri is poisoned. And look at this. Level 32. Thrasher, of course, getting some points. And he's coming out with a coughing. So let's go right ahead and go with Nessie right here. And let's go with a rain dance. Sludge attack hitting us. Surf attack powered up. 
And let's continue on with the onslaught with Nessie right here. Because we got five turns to use this. Thrasher grows to level 33. And here we go. Surf attack yet again. And we got one more coughing. So let's go right ahead and bam. Just like that, we win. Okay, okay. I'll tell you where he is. Hmm, where is he? Okay, so homeboy here is going to be like, listen carefully. We stashed the real director in the underground warehouse. It's at the far end of the Goldenrod Tunnel. I am a nice guy. I will give you the basement key to get the underground warehouse. Take it with gratitude. And with gratitude, we get it. Look at that. Okay. Huh. We, okay, so he's already said, he's already said what he needed to say. Anywho. Yeah, we got a Pokemon uh, that's about to faint. So we're going to let this Pokemon faint. Because we are finally done with this episode right here. So it's going to be a fun one, guys. A real, real fun one in the next episode. Because we're going to be going into the... Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, we're going to be going into the next episode. In the underground path. Or underground warehouse. And that's where we're going to be do, well, doing a lot, of, a lot more of the work right here. And I plan to actually separate these into three episodes. That way we can get to episode 25. So... Thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being as supportive as possible and being very patient with me and all that. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. See you guys.